So today we're doing an unboxing for, and I know what I ordered this time. Our last unboxings, I couldn't remember what I ordered. <laughs> so this is coming from Paul C. Buff. Every single light that I have in this studio comes from Paul C. Buff. So we have some Alien B 400s, 800s, multiples of each one, multiple colors. I like the pink. I have some turquoise. Uh, different soft boxes, strip box, 32 by 40, 30 by 60, um, all from Palsy Buff. Great company. I will include a link to their um, website in the comments below. I have been watching the Milky Way online retreat, newborn retreat. A lot of the newborn photographers use a PLM umbrella which I was very intrigued with. I use a really large soft box anyway for my newborns. I use a 30 by 60, and the, we know from one of our previous videos that the larger the soft box, the softer our lighting. And with newborn photography, we want some soft lighting. So I thought I would look into the Paul C. Buff PLM 86 inch umbrella. So I'm going to be honest that this was actually already opened at one time because <laughs> I've used it already but some of the things that came today have not been so we're gonna act like super surprised like what's in here but you're going to be surprised so this is very very large umbrella it's a shoot through umbrella so the reason I got two separate shipments is my fault. I didn't do my research enough. I got the shoot through umbrella and then I realized what I actually wanted with the umbrella. <laughs> is um, the fabric that covers this side of it and then you use a different um, outside cover so that you're bouncing the light from this side into this side. But it's really nice and I've used it this way and I love it this way. The only downside I had with shooting, I'm gonna to try to move this so that Isaac can see what I'm doing here. The only problem I had with just shooting it this way is I couldn't tilt my camera down, or sorry, my light down because it hits my tripod leg. So just slide through there and to see what the problem is, and I'm loosening it instead of tightening it. I can't tilt it any more down. And this really was not as big of an investment as the soft boxes. I believe the umbrella was 39. Not bad. That's why I was I grabbed it without even <laughs> My husband just came in and he's and I grabbed it without even worrying about my budget. What's in these other two boxes? So I did a lot of shooting. I did uh, three newborn sessions. We did a 2-year-old session and headshots with this big shoot through umbrella and it did great. It did great. I'm just super curious. So then I bought some of the accessory pieces and I'm assuming that's what's in here. So let's see if my assumption is right. So this Cover the PLM white front diffusion fabric so it will go around the umbrella allowing the light to actually come back this way I am gonna open the other one at the same time and maybe we can figure out I might and I'm still not sure like I said I haven't used these um, my concern I bought the black um, I'm trying, we'll have to see what it's called. I will open it up and we'll see what it's actually called. The PLM black outer cover fabric. Because what I was afraid would happen is if I'm shooting here and I put on the diffusion panel, my light, my main light source is still going through the umbrella and I'm afraid I won't get enough light coming back this way. So then I thought, well, I'll order the black outer cover and it will prevent light from leaking out but then black actually absorbs light. So I'm thinking what I might have to do is go back and order the other umbrella <laughs> that has an actual silver lining on the inside so that the light will bounce back. So we're gonna play around a little bit and try them both out and see what I think. 
Um, like I said, it wasn't a huge cost. Even having both, I think if I were to do the little two-year-old session that we did was beautiful. And she's tall enough that I didn't need to physically angle the light down as much because it angled a little bit and that was okay. That was just right. But for a newborn, posing the newborn down low, I actually needed it to angle a little bit more. So, got this here. And I've never done this before, so let's see. Okay, so it looks like what I'm gonna need to do is it's got these um, tips that look like they just connect onto these little tips. So that looks easy enough. So I'm just gonna open it up. <gasps> it's silver on the inside. That is fantastic. I don't know if I just didn't read all of the description on their website, but that means I don't have to worry about buying the silver umbrella. So let's try to, I'm so short. I'm trying to decide if I can do this without taking the umbrella off. Let's come up here first. And maybe do. When you're five one, life is so much harder. Oh, I see what I did wrong there. Okay. 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 And then I'm assuming this lines up. Loosen it up for me a little bit. I gotta line it up with the hole first. Okay, hold on. I think I need one on that side. Oh, there we go. Got it. Okay. I need to tilt it back. Well, that's pretty handy. Yeah, I kind of did. So these little things are just clipping over the end of the, so there's the end of the umbrella and it just slides right into there. It's pretty easy. That excites me. I think that will be great that it's silver on the inside. So then let's look at our, and I think for this one, this will have to be out like that or else, um, make, make it smaller like that. And then will it be easier to, Drape over. Okay. There's okay, probably one instructions. <laughs> you twist it, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's just never coming off, let's be honest. So the benefit of this, like I said before, when I was just shooting from this side, I couldn't tilt my light down, but this allows me to grab my handle and now I can point my light down at my baby. Am I, am I on? And it should hit that and be able to just bounce right back. So let's see, Aaron. Go a little higher, and the benefit of this too is I can still see my power settings here. Okay, so I'm gonna bring you right here. You're gonna be our hot audio girl. <laughs> uh, probably about here. We're gonna rotate this here. 
bring it in super close because it is such a soft power. I mean, I can increase it or decrease it, but the benefit of this is the diffuse, soft diffuse lighting. Maybe downside or just not downside as much as different way of shooting is in my newborn studio, I actually had to pull out some light bulbs because it is such a low power light. My ambient light was leaking into my images. Um, I'm not gonna take the time to do that now, of course. <laughs> yep, you're, it's just a beautiful picture. So my shutter speed needs to be below 400 or below 200. And my ISO, let's see what my ISO needs to be. All right, so I'm gonna go a little bit darker on my ISO. There we go. Yeah. So it's giving me a lot less um, contrasty shadows, which is fine. Different, different times call for different. So I don't know that it's a light that I would necessarily use on headshots. This is never coming off of this light head ever again. I'm just gonna say that. <laughs> it's one of the benefits of having multiple uh, palsy buff. Palsy buff has not given us any compensation for these. We're doing these because I honestly, truly enjoy my alien bees and all of the soft boxes and all of the stuff. We're not getting any money from Palsy buff. I just love their stuff. It's a nice, simple starter set. Easy to adjust your power. It has a modeling bulb so you can see what's actually happening to your images. So I just really like their stuff. But yeah, for newborns, that's exactly what I was looking for. A little bit of a softer light source. Um, for headshots, I would probably still come in and use the other heads with a narrower light source and get more of a contrasty image. But I got it together. I'm very excited. It doesn't look like I'm going to have to um, buy this silver umbrella. So that makes me pretty happy. Um, I'm shooting at uh, ISO 250, which is well within the limits of my camera. So I'm not going to have any noise or any grain. Um, I love the bigger catch light in her eye. That's really nice. Very fun. I love it. So there's our, there's our unboxing, our Palsy Buff umbrella. The white front diffusion fabric. And the black outer cover fabric, which our little surprise today was that there's silver on the inside. So that I did not have to go back and buy the silver umbrella. Please subscribe to our channel. Click the bell so that you receive notifications when we post new videos. And as my farewell, since I forgot to introduce myself, my name's Amber with Two Color Photography, and we hope to see you next time. Thank you, bye.